Hey, Cali Q isn't the only one who can make videos on Auden Chronicle 100 Heroes. <laughs> All right, they just released a new trailer, so let's uh, let's take a peep at it, shall we? Oh, this, this game this game is very exciting. I only found out about it through Cali. But man, sight am I. oh, there's voice acting. Oh, and there is much that I can see. Oh, Baba, Ellen Keeley. The tale is the voice actor. of a fated group of three. Yeah, there's the main characters. And their links whoa. to 100 heroes. Whoa, hold on, look at, whoa. Look at, look at that, this chick, she looks crazy. Look at all these, look at all these designs. Oh my gosh. Sm <laughs> smug. The smugness. Oh, this wolf dude. Oh, there's like some kind of like, there's, is there all kinds of different like races of beasts? I know I've seen like, I've seen like shark people, and there's wolf people. There's, oh yeah, there's, there's, there's the shark people back there. Uh, there's like a dragon. There's like a dragon dude. Whoa, it's cool. Destiny. Look at this, look at this huge diverse cast of characters. Wow. Shablooey! Shazam! A Uden Chronicle 100 Heroes. Oh, I'm ready. Our heroes and Bonds of friendship. Let's go. Power, power friendship. Oh, yeah. Every JRPG Five needs power friendship. Souls will reveal themselves. Ooh. Gar. Hey you must be the new guy Emir mentioned. They will share Ooh, the, the burden. Voice acting sounds really good. As his fiercest allies. Hmm. Those who walk with Noah. So does, does each main character get different party members based on and many their more path? Will follow the path? I am Hildy, Lieutenant Kessling's aide. Oh, look at this, look at this gameplay! Oh my goodness! Same, a scion of the Empire and his comrades, each filled with youthful ambition. That was like some fate <laughs> animation right there. Ooh, that was like a, that was like a link then, attack. <laughs> bandits and outlaws among their number. Oh, bandits! Pretty soon. General Kogan's gonna declare himself ruler of this whole land. Yeah, guys. He can't do squat about it. Trust. Uh, he's gonna be the ruler. Maybe he's back on the whole. <laughs> but you're about to get an iron ball bashing. Oh. Hoo-ah! Hoo -ah. Oh my gosh. <laughs> That's so. <laughs> <laughs> That's so crazy. <gasps> Shark people. It's so wacky. But it's, it's, it's the wackiness that makes now. the games fun. The tougher the exterior, the stronger their hearts, and more enduring. Literally, sh literal sh sh sand sharks. Sh sand sharks, yes. I, I speak good English. English, my first language. I'm sorry. I was in a hurry. What high Is this the Magical Girl Squad? Alright, evil doer. Oh my gosh, it is. It is the sound Sailor of Moon intensifies. What magical adventures away Yo, let's go! Allies. Magical Girl Elisa. <laughs> it's canon in this world the too. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's that's low key incredible. The heroes will gather at a new place to call home. Oh, is it are they gonna show off some of the city oh, building? Yeah. <laughs> whoa, oh, whoa, really look at that chick in the middle. A lively place She's like a Oni sure. kind of creature. Why does she have an egg on her head? What the heck? Those who chase dreams. There's so many just different Those character designs. Wait, is that like some kind of? Oh my gosh! There's a little capybara man. Will find what form the heck? In this new home. You like card games? Yes. <gasps> Yo, card games? Actually, we actually get mini games. Brings them together. Fishing? Heck yeah. The top. Is expressing the very I love fishing in mini games. I don't care what anybody says. Yo, Beyblades, <laughs> Tidpin Slammer, <laughs> for all my the world is with you fans. <laughs> you want to slam? The same can be said for these. Yeah, there's there's a dragon person. Is it some kind of like spirit channeler lady? We were imperial goons. And I'm still sorry about that. What was that? What was that for? It's acting. A truth. Strength on a diversity. But that's the fun in it. I love these sprites. They look so good. For now, there's all that I can see. An undead dude. You wish to know the fate of these heroes. 
<laughs> Wave? Wavy? Interesting. Yourself. There's like elf Come. characters too? Our tail cannot Yo! Cowboy Lizard Man! Let's go! Lips. Oh, CJ Garoo? Yo! There's a Kangaroo Man! Shabalooey! A Yudin Chronicle. <laughs> Hundred heroes. That's such a funny word. April 23rd. Available mm. April 23rd, 2024. Rabbit and Bear, you guys are killing it with, with this Favorite game. Now? You are building yeah. up hype like crazy. Oh, man. I'm not going to be able to play it when it comes out. That sucks. I have to wait. Because <laughs> I have so much on my plate that unintentionally rhymed. I did not mean for that to, <laughs> to rhyme. Oh my gosh, it's just there's so many just characters. All the voice acting sounded really good. I didn't really get to hear much of the music, but the music sounded great. The gameplay looks just incredibly fun. I wonder how many characters you can put in your party. I'm gonna have to... Callie, you better hurry up and put out that, uh, <laughs> that, that beta impression so I can... <laughs> so I can get an actual number on party members and structure and such. Oh, man. Wow. And yeah, like I said earlier, I, I only... Hold on, let me, let me pull him up. Let me pull up the boy. <laughs> We get the Cali Q community in here as well. Yeah, here he is. This man right here has single-handedly just been, just increased my hype for this game. I actually had this game on my top 10 list as far as most anticipated games for this year. And seriously, the more I see of it, just the, all those, those mini games, I love mini games. Okay, I'm an avid Yakuza fan. I love the Yakuza games. I love the Judgment games. I just love, I love all of RGG's games, but I love all the silly, goofy mini games that they have. And this game seems to just have, they had what, they had, they had fishing, they had some kind of Beyblade mini game. I wonder if you could, I wonder if it's like pocket circuit racing where you can customize the Beyblade with all kinds of different, I wonder how deep these mini games go. Are they just like surface level mini games that you do for fun and for collectibles and possibly achievements and such, or is there a bunch of strategy and replayability to them? That's what I really want to know. Oh, they had some kind of like... They had some kind of like card game. The cards had like numbers on them. Hold on, let me go back to it. Oh, I still can't get over there. They have magical girls of shark people. <laughs> this game has everything. I was half expecting Rain Schwarzer to just jump scare me <laughs> in this game. Huh, so is this, is this, is this two player and this is just three separate sort of decks that you get, you can build and then you fight against, okay, yeah, look. So 14, 16, 8, is this cards, you build three separate decks and then fight with them on three separate battlefields sort of? Because yeah, there's an attack stat, there's this stat next to it, which... Normally in games like, say, Magic, that would be defense, but it's a, it's at a zero. So I wonder if that's some kind of like special ability or maybe like a support card you could put in there. Oh, and I, lo I love card games in games. <laughs> Just card games in general. I was a huge Yu-Gi-Oh! and Magic player as, as a kid. Oh, I love I loved me my Life Link and Vampire cards. <laughs> Nobody liked playing with me. <laughs> yeah. Oh my gosh. Seriously, this, this this trailer just my hype was already really high. This just rose it exponentially. I have I have so much on my plate I have to get through this here. I I have Kurono Kiseki 2. I've got Chrono Trigger. Oh, what else do I have? I have already forgotten what I'm supposed to be, <laughs> be playing. I have I have the rest of the East games I wanna go through. There's Tokyo Xanadu, possibly. Trust Through Daybreak is coming out later. I'm probably going to have to play that. East 10 is coming out later this year. That's something that I would like to get to as well, but I don't uh, I don't know. <laughs> it depends on how far I get in my East journey. Just, uh, yeah, Rabbit and Bear Studios. These trailers are doing a really good job of selling the game. Just the, the sprites look great. Oh, I just, I can't. Man, the voice acting is great. The environment, the, the environments, look, the environments look, they, they look so colorful and bright. There's all kinds of things. Paddy fields over <laughs> on the left side there. I still can't get over the, <laughs> still gotta get over the, the magical girl thing. That was hilarious. Bro, shark people are gonna 
are gonna low key be the best units. This guy pulling a 10-10, throwing his throwing his iron balls everywhere. <laughs> oh, Callie, thank you for introducing me to this to this game. Seriously, it's really only because of his channel that I even found out this game existed in the first place. So special shout out to him. Not that he needs it, but <laughs> if anything, if anything, he's the one, the one helping me out with this. Either way, I think I have rambled for long enough. I'm gonna end things here for now. Thank you guys for checking this video out. Leave a like if you enjoyed it. Comment down below what you're excited for of this game. What looks good to you. Oh man. <laughs> and hey, subscribe if you want to see more content from yours truly. That would, that would really help me out. And well, I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out everybody. Alright, what's next?